Okay, welcome back. And if you're not back and you're here for the first time, hi, welcome. I am Princess P, the real princey. Um, to subscribe and stay a while, hit the P that's here. There's a crown there and it's it's on a P. That's me, Princess P. <laughs> if you've been here, you stay in here, you ain't going nowhere. Welcome back. Thank you. Big up my real ones. Real recognize real. Hey. <laughs> I'm dropping off my shoebox today. Shoeboxes today. And upon further investigation, which I'm annoyed about, they said that you can put it in a clear container. Funny story. When I was trying to search and hackle up Andrea's body to find box and hackle up myself to search and go in a basement and see, Lord, do I have any shoeboxes? Because I got rid of all my shoeboxes and I put them into this clear container. I love these, right? So I took out one of Dwayne's boots and I put it into one of these bins and I was like, yo, why didn't they say we can use bins? Like this makes so much more sense to me. Well, they said shoe box, so I'm gonna go with shoe box to later find out that we can use these bins. Now I'm gonna change this one. As you saw in the last video, I didn't wrap this Uggs box. So I'm going to put this box, this package into one of these bins. And I feel kind of bad because I should have put the other ones in bins, but I'm not going to show all of them aquiline. Not, No, we can't do it. So they're already wrapped poorly. They look festive. They're together. We're going to stick with these two just how they are, but I am going to rebox that. So let me do that right quick. While I'm reboxing, I guess I can show you in detail what's in my box in case you didn't see the first video when I was boxing, I basically went to Dollarama and Dollar Tree and got a whole bunch of stuff to put in here. And this whole shoe box thing is from Samaritan's Purse where they're going to, I think this year they're going to Costa Rica or Central America, I don't know. It said, they said Costa Rica and West Africa and they're dropping off different shoe boxes or storage containers of stuff that people donate. So for each box, you are going to donate $10. That's gonna help with shipping. And you're gonna fill this up. And yeah, I went ahead and I did that. My cousin Marsha told me about it and I got really excited, but now I feel like, lad, did I go overboard? <laughs> Anyhow, let's repackage this. This, these are some washcloths. I got a mask. Um, this is for a girl who is 10 to 14. So I did get a small package of pads, bathing suit pieces. Um, these are the bot water bottles. These are actually $1.25 for both from Dollar Tree. Socks. Most of these things are from Dollar Tree. Um, this pencil case is really cute. That pencil case is from Dollarama, but everything else in the inside is from Dollar Tree. And some things I had at home, like I already had some extra pencils and the highlighters and stuff. So those things were with me. Oops, sorry. And yeah, I got pens, there's pencil crayons in here, pencils, erasers, um, sharpeners, highlighters, glue. No liquids go in here at all, that's unfortunate. You can't sell, send lotion or body wash. I got her a brush, glow stick. Um, this is a little cosmetic bag full of stuff. In this cosmetic bag, there is lipstick, chapstick, Hair clips, sorry, twist ties, or not twist ties, sorry. You know what I'm saying, Blah. nail clip. Toothbrush, unfortunately I cannot bring toothpaste because it is considered a liquid or a gel. And a pack of comb, and you know this pack of comb is a good value, $1.25, what is this? Honestly, different sizes. So the footprint for each bag is the same. Um, for the boy, I included a little bit more gender specific things like Avengers theme and I sent him combs as well but um like no lipstick no lip gloss you know and then this is for an age five to nine and five to nine boy girl and then girl 10 to 14 so that's what I think all right white a puzzle I really like this puzzle bandages two different notebooks a flashlight, LED flashlight. Um, look at these ponchos. Yeah, rain ponchos. And one adult one, one more dad, or guardian. A little bag 
some workbooks, a little dress, and maybe now I had another blouse and shorts. Maybe I can fit that in there now. So I'm gonna go ahead and repackage this into the clear clean container. Give me a few. Final touches. I did write a card. You can include a card or you can include a picture or whatever. I did not include a photo. I just included a card with some words. And this is my little keepsake for them. Canadian keychain. Whether they have key or not, they can keep it. And yeah, I'm just packing up the rest of the things. This did fit a little bit more because it's deeper, which I am happy about. And yeah, I could fit those extra clothes that I wasn't able to put in the other one. Which is nicer. Packing is an art, man. Like, really and truly. A little mask. Okay, see another part. Yeah. That's it for this. Okay, so I went ahead and I put my labels on. These are the labels here. You print it out from the webpage, Samaritan's Purse. The link is gonna be in the description box. And this program is accepting from National, what is it, National Collection Week is the 16th to the 22nd. So I labeled this one, Tick Girl, 10 to 14, Boy, 5 to 9, Girl, 5 to 9. So yeah, I didn't decorate this box, so I put the tissue, which failed, and that failed, but it's okay. Something is better than nothing, and I love this so much more. Oh lord, I feel some type of way not giving the other two a container, because this container is so useful, you know? Like, you can just reuse it. But am I going to do that? No, I'm not. And I don't want my head to take me either, because my head take me, mega do it. Because that's what's in my heart. All right, let me go drop these off. Come with me? Come with me. <laughs> okay, so I'm on route, and um, it's not too far, which is good. There's a lot of different locations. When I looked it up, there's quite a few. I mean, quite a few per city. Not necessarily a few in each city and I guess they are calling for if people want to be a drop-off location volunteers in Alberta I believe all of them somewhere and let's just get this done get it off my brain I wanted to do this earlier I wanted to do it like at the beginning of the week so if anybody wanted to also pack a box they could have gone in you still can actually i mean it's until the 22nd so or you could donate online if you want to do that to pack a box they will pack the box for you which might work because i probably would have saved money if i did it that way because we go overboard find things and i sure did throw it in the bag <laughs> at dollar tree lord have his mercy anyways Let's see how it goes when we get there. All right, so I'm here. What I'm gonna do first is go inside and investigate. Cause I'm not trying to lug nothing inside and then, oh, you have to go to this entrance. You have to go to that entrance. So this is my drop off. I don't know where this church is. St. John of the Cross. Okay. Let's see. Disinfecting in public. For sure. Oh. We are in the right place. I did. I will. Both hands. Okay. So you can order these shoe boxes ahead of time. Those ones. They're free. Those are some small ass shoe boxes. Hmm. Okay. People use regular boxes. Some people didn't wrap their box. That's possible. All right. That's very cute. Um, yeah, those bins are good. Wow, why did I get these huge ass boxes? Oh, my children will be very happy. Cause I'm getting things, one things, one things, one things. 
Okay. That one is all a roll on. Yeah, we should get an antibiotic friend. Them separates are not allowed in some country. Huh. That doll tried to escape, you see it? Peeping out. You brute, yeah? <laughs> this wrapping is cute, actually. Just a bag of stuff, I guess. Let's talk to somebody. Ollie, Ollie, oxen free! Ollie, Ollie, oxen free! I'm not just gonna go and drop my box like that, huh? Like, my box ton up. I don't want nobody to try and take and scrummage through and all of them something there. Plus, I want my tax receipts. Can't tell no lie. Oh. Let's look at the office. Okay. Nobody in it. Hi, I, I'm good. I came to drop off some boxes. Boxes? Yeah, for the. Oh, did you drop it off there? I didn't drop it off yet, but um, I wanted to drop it off. But they said if you do over a certain amount, you get a tax receipt. Oh, I love that. I do know that because that's the Samaritan first. Not, that's not the parish. Oh, okay. Yeah. So here you just drop off the box. Yeah, we just drop off the box and they pick it up. Okay. Yeah, it's not the parish, so. Uh, got you. Got you. They pick you. it up, but they put it in you know whatever, whatever they send it to oh. the. Okay. Okay, so I just drop it off. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> okay. That was simple. I know. I thought it was more complicated than that. Thank you. Okay, okay bye. So the woman said you just drop off the box. So warm to the ten dollars. They don't want me ten dollars per box. I guess you have to donate online. Hmm. Interesting. Let me go. My boxes are pretty good, but I do want to wrap them. Like some secureness. Let's see. Both centers? Mm -hmm. And then they'll come take it to um, wherever they're shipping it from? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think it's Alberta. Yeah. Because I went online. Okay. Yeah. So then I'll do that. So it's all good. So then you I'm just donate to... online then? Yeah, just go on the uh, Samaritan Paris website. Yeah. And it'll say, um, like if you I saw it at the bottom there, yeah, to make yeah. your $10 donation. Yeah. Okay. Thanks for reminding me that yeah. I'm going to do that. I didn't do that yet. Okay, cool. Yeah, then you, then you get it covered, right? Mm hmm Yeah, wonderful. Year, I'm glad Thank you. Able to do it. This year, so I don't want to get going. And yeah, exactly. Before, uh, it gets crazy. Exactly. But yeah, all good. Thank you. Thank you. Are you too? Okay, I think the boxes are okay. Let's see my boxes. Oh, a nice local lady come help me with some information. She brings all six boxes. My boxes are okay, right? Like, this looks closed closed. And then this too. And this one is a little bit. And then that. Hmm. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna leave them just like this. This is a little... This does have a little... Things, so it should be okay. Have is a mercy. I mean, I will win. Oh God. Okay. All right. Oh, you guys don't even know how out of breath I get for these little little things. Like my heart starts to race. Hmm. All of me, I climb the stairs. God forbid my baby in the end. Catch my breath. And this mask. Oh, Lord have mercy. Does not make it easier, boy. Mm. Okay. Mm. Boxes are wrapped so neatly. So cute. I get it now. I get it, I get it. Good learning experience. I think my boxes are okay. I think they're okay. 
Now a little prayer for you. I'm gonna go. And it is done. You know what? Um, and I prayed over the boxes and I prayed over all of the boxes actually. Everything that was there. Um, you know what side of box for me do? Could I all make six box? Looking at those boxes there, that could have made how many boxes? But you know what? It's okay. <laughs> Definitely okay. Definitely an experience. I'm not to say I would actually do less next time. I'd probably do the same thing. But in the clear containers. Until next time, thank you for following me on this journey of Samaritan's Purse, Operation Christmas Child. I made the box. I bought the stuff, packed the boxes deliver the boxes the boxes are done they're going to the child in jesus name cover them lord god and that's it until next time if you would like to stay a while and continue me with me on this journey there's a p right down here and it has a crown on it subscribe that's me princess p the real princey to all my real ones big up yourself real recognize real you don't know Bye.